In this discussion, you can see edge calculation using depth field in Odoo, and this discussion is dedicated to other spawn and space connection on Bali. As requested, same example. Let me show you in student profile and going to editor. Now I'm going to add one uh, date field like birth. Oh, sorry, but that equal to fields dot dad and we are using this string attribute for the labeling purpose death of birth and I am adding as a required equal to true and one more field I have to add for the labeling purpose like once the user will add a date and it will display into another field as a character field I'm adding here student edge equal to fields dot care total edge something like that and here I'm just converting this field into compute field so let me add here like get edge from student copy this one and paste here sorry one more library we have to add here is a date time so i'm using import date time and here i'm adding like one field today date equal to date time dot date dot today so simply i'm getting today's date after we have to use now we have to calculate that uh, this field this date field once the user will uh, fill this uh, date of birth then after based on that we have to convert into years odoo provides one mixing in in these fields and it will convert into string to date and time format also date format and uh, it's vice versa like you can also convert your date and time to string let me give you one more example here i'm using like uh, for loop i have to add here because this is a compute field and uh, stood but date equal to stu here fields then after dot we have to use as a date and time then after dot to underscore date time and here we have to pass the string value like as we get from uh, as usually we are using this uh, date field so here I'm using like stood dot be that and simply like uh, this field converted into string to the date format same as like today's date and now we have two dates like one is a date of birth and we have a today's date so based on this calculation like uh, we are doing one calculation and based on that calculation we are getting students age like uh, total age equal to and we are using here today underscore date minus b date and then after we have to convert into days then after we have to divide into 365 days and then after we are getting actual number of years and what we are doing is we are just converting result getting into float and simply we have to use as a string concatenate because we are uh, we are why we need to do this because this field is character field and now simply i'm i'm doing is stud dot student underscore edge equal to 
total underscore edge let me add one condition here if stud dot be that is available then this code will execute otherwise like stud dot student edge is blank like not provided something like this and no need to return return anything and what I'm doing is I'm going to in view part in form view I will add here field name equal to be that and then after field equal to student underscore edge simply and now I'm going to terminal and try to upgrade the module again going to browser and I'm refreshing the page okay it's complete successfully completed so I'm going to student profile and click to this XYZ student here in December and once I will click here you can see this this total cha uh, total age field calculate based on the logic oops we have an error so you can see here we have a two different types and it won't be calculate because both having a different type let me go to inside the code and here we have to use as a date date instance because usually this we added here as a date time again I am going to restart the service because we already changed in Python and and I am going to restart going to browser and refresh the page so you can see here 21 so let me double uh, let's double check this okay I'm going to new tab and calculate online okay first one 1998 and here is a 16th day and this is our December month and this is current date click okay you can see here 21 year old so our logic is correct and let me show you my favorite actress birth date okay 31st May Okay. Slash zero five. And once I will click here, you can see she is thirty nine years old. Let me show you one more thing. Might be you didn't notice. Once I will click here, like I will I will select to this twelfth May nineteen eighty one or I'm just changing the year so you can see like uh, 1984 and I selected the same like May the first May 1984 and you can see once I clicked here uh, it's changed but uh, the still like total ages didn't change instantly and once I click to this save button you can see now it's reduced like 36 so if you want to also if you want to calculate based on these direct changes based on the user input it is also possible only we need to just uh, use one decorator going to editor and here like what we have to do is 
at the red api it depends and here what we have to do like if this birth date is changed the time this cal this method will automatically call that's it now i'm going to terminal restart the service no need to upgrade the module and going to front end side and once i will refresh the page okay i'm again going to this tab and i'm using this sunny doll edge okay this one i'm just copy and here i'm just past here tab and enter so you can see here it's a 63 year old for the double check you can see here it's a 63 year old so like this way you can calculate age calculation there is no any separate uh, fields is available for the sam and one more interesting thing i found is this piece of code is very quite good i'm just copy this one the whole code and going to terminal and paste here okay and just copy this one and uh, I'm just removing this one and instead of I'm using my field name like B that and I'm not using this one and yes one more thing is you can see here uh, this guy used this the pure pure date and time library to convert string to this specific format like m d and y but right now we are not using this logic we are using our framework logic in future you have to use either this one or it or this one it's up to you it depends on you and i'm just copy cut and paste here instead of this print i'm using to store the string inside the student edge so right now this logic is a logic having like years, month, day, hours, uh, minutes and seconds. Going to terminal and restart the service only and going to this student profile and refresh the page you can see here this now you can see you are minus 63 years old 10 months 20 days 9 hours 15 minutes and 21 seconds old you can see this calculations going wrong because it's appearing as a minus 63 years so let me change that logic also only what we have to do is we have to change this days left logic current date we should it should be always the first one and then after minus from the older date and again going to terminal and restart the service and going to the browser and refresh the patch now it's a better output you are 63 years 10 months 20 days and 9 hours 15 minutes and 21 seconds old Okay. Let me print this one also. Now you can see you are 39 years old, 3 months, 27 days, 6 hours, 2 minutes and 9 seconds old. So like this way you can calculate 
and yeah please forget about uh, this actress or actors date of birth this is the funny part here doubt please comment below and see you in next session